its Biele months to the Under-23 Nations Cup in Senegal, and training has commenced in Enners in Abuja under the supervision of Coach Samson Siasia. The Under-23 team on Wednesday played a friendly against Coach Swad, a more regular tutored superstars. The Flying Eagles were three goals up before the superstars replied twice to make it 3-2 at halftime. Three more goals were scored in the second half, which gave the Samson Siasia boys a 6-2 win at the end. In an exclusive interview with PTV, Coach Samson Siasia say a lot still needs to be done and he is yet to decide which player to take to the tournament, though he admitted that he has one or two of the players in mind. Standing here with me is the coach of the Under-23 national team as they prepare for the upcoming Under-23 Nations Cup in Senegal. Good afternoon, coach. Good afternoon. Well, I saw your training with the boys. You seem not to be too impressed with your defenders. Uh, what are the next steps? Well, I've not actually I've not been impressed uh, since we started because we don't have uh, enough players uh, in camp. They're all going back to their club, so it's kind of difficult to try to prepare for Senegal without players. So it's, it's a big problem. We'll just play the game now using the ones that we have at home. And uh, for more indication, we think we still have a lot, very long way to go. But we can't stop. If we're still going to go, we just need to do what we have to do. These players need to come back from their clubs. They can't, keep, they can't be going on Wednesdays and on Sundays and all that. Then the camp is empty. If we don't have players, there's no way we can prepare well. I know it's been a challenge having the foreign-based players here with you. Have you been communicating with the various clubs out there? Well, foreign-based players, that will be the last issue. If we go to our training camp, hopefully they'll come because they have a FIFA window to see some of them. And we'll still talk to them and say, if they let them come, but we're not depending so much on them because, you know, they will disappoint us. We see them, uh, I think, in Mexico, no, in Morocco, as planned, on the FIFA window, and decide on which ones will join the team. I haven't seen them play. Then we'll start talking to the, uh, the teams on when they have to release them, if to play one or two games before they come back to their club. That's decisions uh, we we'll have to make with their club size. Yeah, with the tournament just a month away, and you are yet to decide on you know which of the players to use, is that not a big problem to the Olympic in, in Rio next year? No, it's not a big problem. We just need to. We know we have a team, but we need to make the team a little bit stronger. So we're looking for players that will take you know will come and make the team a little bit more stronger than the ones we have because uh, we're going to play very. We're in a very difficult group, you know, for us to qualify for the Olympics, which is a big, you know, thing for Nigeria and for us as individuals. I think our preparation hasn't been that good. Yeah. And lastly, sir, and you are uh, looking at the training. I seem to have seen one or two players. I'm very sure you must have, you know, have one or two players in mind as well. No, we have a couple of them, but we need 25 good players at least so that we can have the bench would be good in case someone someone gets injured. But most of these players are not even here. We don't have, even have 10 of them. And that's a struggle. We can't have players outside instead of doing what we have to do, like tactics and conditionings and all that stuff. We don't know what they do in their club sides. You know, so we need to be together to make sure you know, we have a formidable team going to Senegal. It's nice talking to you, sir. You're welcome. Okay. Yeah, and that's me talking to the under-23 Flying Eagles coach, talking about Samson Siasa, who used to be a veteran for the national team as well and it's good having him here as a prepare for the flying for the nation's cup in senegal hopefully they will be able to get a ticket to rio olympic <laughs>